Hey, let's briefly talk about the real-time appointment booking in Go High Level with, with our AI voice assistants. So first of all, you'll need a calendar uh, inside Go High Level. Then what you have to do is create a new agent in uh, Synflow, either inbound or outbound. So for example, here we have a inbound agent. You click on real-time booking. Instead of this here, you'll have connect to GHL. First of all, if you want to use this functionality, you need to connect to an existing sub account because on Go High Level in the agency view, you don't have calendars. Remember that, don't connect it to your agency. So you need to connect to your uh, sub account that has that specific calendar. You click here, you choose your calendar, you click next, you wait, and is loaded. The settings here, it's there are the time zone where you need to have it. You can also pass this via the variables if it's an outbound agent, but you really need to pass it in this format here. This is specific slash blah blah blah. The first appointment date is the first date when the AI will propose an appointment. So for example, today we are on 2 April. And here it's 3 April. So it will start proposing appointments from tomorrow on. If I put 5 April, it will start making appointments from, uh, from Friday on, from 5 April on. The number of days, the number of days here slider will let the AI assistant to specify how many days there are available. So in a calendar, all days are available, but the agent, for example, if we keep it to the 2, two April, will propose the next three days past 3 April. So to propose 3, 4, and 5 April as, hey, uh, do you want to book, uh, we have availabilities on 3, 4, or 5 April, which one do you like? That's good. Uh, the number of time slots in a single day, meaning from the number of days, uh, so on 3, for example, it will propose, hey, on Wednesday, we have availability at 9, 10, or 12 p.m., meaning three time slots in a single day. You can put it to two, or you can put it to one. And then we say, hey, on Wednesday, we only have an availability at 12. But that doesn't mean if the user says, okay, I don't, I don't want 12. I want uh, later that day you have something. The AI will go and look if there's something there. But as a default, it will propose only one availability into that day until the user requests so, or if they are not, it will not say, it will, hey, we're fully booked here. Then we have the minimum hour difference. So minimum hour difference is uh, the hour difference between the time slots in that single day. If we have like one hour, not zero, this is a bug. If we ha have one hour difference, it will say, hey, we have availability on uh, 3 April, uh, at 10 and at 11. That's if you have like one hour difference, you can put like two hour difference and say, hey, we have availability at 10 and 12. Which one do you like? So this is it. After you have those settings, you click save and you can use now your appointment booking. What's important to know? If you're an agency, in case you're for an agency, automatically you will link up your main account with the agency account in Go High Level. So you will have the ability to import new actions. So here on your main account, you will not be able to use the Go High Level real-time booking because you need to be linked to a sub account to have access to a calendar. So what you can do if you want to experiment, is create for yourself um, a demo sub account here, or use another sub account where you can experiment with that. Because here you'll not be able to use it because this is this main uh, account is linked to the agency who doesn't have a calendar. But yeah, that's all. Thank you very much. Bye bye.